Hello Baby Brown, I have decided to make another video and the single reason for that is because the other day somebody asked me a question that struck a chord and the question was um, why on earth would I want to learn figure drawing um, what would I gain what's what's the benefit wouldn't it be better perhaps to um, to make an extra mortgage payment uh, wouldn't would I be able to do it? Does it require effort on my on my part? I have already enough on my plate. You know, would I be able to do it? Um, or will it be just another stress? I will have to add on top of everything else. And these are all very valid questions. This this is this is actually very important, and I haven't thought of it from that kind of an angle. Uh, so I decided to make this video to to actually tell you about these things. What it is that you get out of it? Why why is it? beneficial how what you get out of it what what how it improves your life or well, one of the one of the things that we really learn while trying to trying to draw the figure is is the art of relationships because it is the, the human body is so complex we deal with smaller simplified bits and pieces now we constantly have to observe and have to figure out the relationship between the bits and pieces and then we can use that knowledge of relationships and place it on a, on a drawing pad and make a drawing. Now the same kind of relationships is so essential for our everyday lives, our day in the real world. Everything is about relationships, how we relate to each other, how we relate to our world, how we relate to our work colleagues, to the work at hand, the, to the challenges that the work brings about and how we, how we, how we deal with it. Um, I want to tell you, I want to tell you a story from my experience. I, I didn't always draw. Um, I've, um, I've been trained as a, as a television journalist for some time. I, I did, you know, reports for, for television news. Um, but on the side I also um, was, were, I was, I was writing scripts. And one of the things that you have to do when you write a script is you can, you have to imagine how it's going to look in that, you know, in that small frame uh, that you see on a television. You have to be able to imagine who's standing on the left, who's standing on the right, where the people moving around, and so on and so on. And uh, there was a scene that I was working on, and I couldn't figure out, um, couldn't imagine how it would look. So I thought to myself, well, I better draw it to to figure it out. Um, and you don't want to know what, what, what ended up as a drawing. It, it wasn't a drawing. It was a terrible disaster. And from then on, I just decided, well, maybe I better learn to draw first. Strangely enough, that thought came to me. And I set aside the script and, and spent the next 10 years learning to draw. So, um, so I spent a lot of time just trying to figuring out, trying to figure out things, reinventing the wheel. Um, later on I decided to, to try my hand at the digital media and so I taught myself um, graphic design, video editing, um, compositing, 3D animation, motion graphics and all of that. And I, I found that, that my, the, the progress of, of teaching myself all these other disciplines was so, so fast, so much faster, the progress, it was so much easier because I knew how to draw. Not because I had to draw with with all these digital tools, but because of all the background, extra extra perception, extra knowledge, extra working with relationships, gave me that extra advantage of of how to pick it up fast, how to learn it. And later on, working as a as a three D animator in in the film industry, I came across lots of colleagues who, for me, just you know, scribbling on the side of the paper, they said. All of them said, oh, that would be so good to, to learn that. And they wanted to learn. But how do you find time and resources if you work full time to do that? So that's, that's somewhere where, where the idea came from to actually do the website, to try to help others not having to go through, I don't know, a, a period of 10 years of struggle. Essentially, the, the lectures that I present sum up uh, the basic elements, the basic basic ingredients, how to how to be successful, how to cut through a lot of information fast, how not having to watch hundred hours of a videos, but just an hour and a half, get that essence, and then you can practice on your own. Then you can progress, and you can always relate back to it. You come, go back and 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 refresh your memory. So. So th there's a whole stack of basic, uh, basic ingredients that are necessary to 
to, to make it successful, to, to make it work. Now, one of the biggest problems and biggest challenges and difficulties that, that I have experienced when I was learning um, was to find, find my place on where I am at. What it is that I'm doing right, what it is that I'm not doing right, what it is, what it is that I need to focus on to get forward, to, to speed up the process, to be able to do it faster and better without, without spending too much time. And, and, and I didn't have that. And one of the biggest things that I thought about when making the website was uh, to provide a, a, a service of an, um, a personalized critique. So it's a critique where you send me your drawing and I record maybe, I don't know, a 10 minute long video where I will actually draw um, over your drawing in a, on, a, on a computer in an electronic medium and explain what it is that you need to focus on. It just puts you on the map, just kind of anchors you, okay, this is where I am. I have a problem with perspective. I have a problem with um, simple geometric forms. I need to look at this, I need to look at that. And then you step out and you move forward and you move forward much, much faster. The thing is that the, the insights, the skills and, and um, the sensibilities that you develop by learning to draw and further on by drawing are exactly the attributes, the, the, the skills that you need to make it out there in the real world. So it is to enrich you. Plus it gives you an absolute sense of satisfaction and, and you know, you can draw. It's huge. Anyway, give it a thought. And um, if you want to give it a try, get some lectures and see where it takes you. Thanks a lot. I'll see you later. Good luck.